Good morning my little potato chips, it's wee Paddy from Across the Shuck and I've got another exciting new video because it's something I've never done before and um, this is a video for a Kickstarter. Now this is by no means a stranger to those in my channel but if you're if you're new to my channel, um, Twisted Assisted is a company run by James Richards in the UK and he has OEMs making knives uh, that are usually slip joints. In fact, most of them, although all three this year have been slip joints, they're knives that can be used in the UK. But he has stepped a wee bit outside the, the, the limits here. This is for a knife that can be used at home round when you're doing gardening. It goes on your belt. As you can see, this is this beautiful little tech lock. So small to go with a knife. I'll get back to that. But if you're a camper, a bushcrafter, a great little camp knife to have on your side for just cutting bits of string, doing odd bits of bush. You could do your camp cooking with this knife. It's fantastic, but it's also a sturdy little knife, which is more, I think, more inclined for the DIY or somebody who just wants something on that he can poke things with and dab. I'm not going to be frightened of breaking blades. Something that's a bit more stronger than most slip joints should be used for. So, fantastic. What is Kickstarter? I am learning just like you. What it is, is James is trying to raise enough money to get the first production run of a thousand knives made. Now, what do you have to do to get it on a Kickstarter? Dead simple. You go on and you pledge on the Kickstarter. What I'm, with my newfound technology, down below you'll have a link that'll take you straight to the Kickstarter. Tap that link, it'll take you straight there, and it explains it fully in case I get something wrong, <laughs> because I have been known to do that. I know you know that. But there's a, a complete rundown on Kickstarter, what you can pledge, Money doesn't come out until the total has been pledged. And pledge means you're you're saying that you're going to buy this knife. When that's when we've reached the total, and you can see the running total on that uh, Kickstarter site, <laughs> over the weekend, it only got launched at the weekend, and to be honest, it didn't get much of a, a view on uh, YouTube or Instagram because there was the knife show in England, and it was there with uh, James at the knife show. So this is its first run on YouTube. I am thoroughly excited. I got this yesterday. I have spent all all last night and all this morning trying to adapt this to how I would like to have it. We'll get back to that as I go into the knife. But all you do is you go and pledge. You'll not be paying money until the target is reached. Then you'll be charged. And from that date, it should be 90 days from he gives the money over to, and this is Best Tech, one of the best OEMs in the world at the minute. This is Best Tech making this knife. And when I show you, you'll just see straight away what a quality product you're getting. And this product is only going to be £69 for those who get in on this Kickstarter campaign. It will be £10 dearer after the Kickstarter stops for anybody. And you will be there. If you're in the Kickstarter, you will get yours before anybody. So, Fantastic that way. £69 for a fixed blade with a proper Kydex sheath with a tech lock, which is unbelievably good. And what else do you get when you get it? You'll get the twisted assisted uh, cleaning cloth and you also get one of their tarot type cards. This, if you can see, the Twisted Gambler. And they're just fantastic. And they have a set of these for every knife that they produce, plus a couple of other ones. But you can buy them on the site separately. But you'll get this free if you buy this in the Kickstarter. Super little thing. You can see the card there with James's logo on it there, which is an amazing logo. But there's lots of these and you can collect them. And there's other things. Tritium is now coming onto the site soon. Just get over there. Once you've finished with the, the Kickstarter, get over on the site or go first. But have a look at what James is doing for us. I am super excited. To, well, I'm lucky enough. I've got this and I can keep it for a while. But I mean, when I get the, you know, when they come out and I get mine, this will be a very well used knife. Let me tell you. So will we talk about the knife? Why not, Paddy? Let's talk about it. First of all, beautiful little size. It's six and a half inches. Six and a half inches long. The knife is. Let's take it out of the Kydex sheath. Let's talk about the Kydex sheath. Look at that little Kydex sheath. It is fantastic. And it's one of these easy clip-on. You push this little button at the bottom, it comes out, you put it over your belt, and you clip it in. Now, depending on what size your belt size is, inside here, you'll see this little thing here. If your belt is bigger than this distance, which is about an inch and a half, mine is, all you do is get your finger, 
Oh. <laughs> it's tight and so it should be. You just snap that out of there, put it somewhere safe, and then I can get my big belt onto it and it goes in like that. It just goes down behind your down behind your belt and clips on completely secure and safe. No button up here, it's not going to affect you. It's down below. The knife itself then goes in here and listen to this. Beautiful. Let me shake this for you like a madman. <laughs> I can't shake it any harder. It's next to nothing, no sound. It is the perfect fit. And they honestly, they did. They spent a lot of the budget getting this perfect. And I, I love that. The little details sometimes make the difference. You have a little ramp here to pull your blade out, which is nice and comfortable. It's not super hard that you're going to jump because some of the Kydex sheets are just too tight. But that just slips in there absolutely beautiful and secure, never coming out of there. So nice little thing. You can push it away gently and take it away from the areas that you don't want to cut off. <laughs> so again, this all this does is when you take this out, you can put it back in here. I'll be removing it because my belt, I have a thick leather belt that, there you go, snips back in again and you can get a thinner inch and a half belt or whatever in there. Fantastic. So well made and so important. You can take this off, just these two screws, take it off and you can carry it as a neck knife. There will be a little ball and chain, you know, them little chains that will come with it in the box and you can carry it as a neck knife in the box. It'll hang down that way. It weighs three and a half ounces. Nothing. It's slim enough, but it's also deep enough to give you a really sturdy carry. This isn't a flimsy little knife. And, and, and that's important too. It's important that I tell you this. Like three and a half inches for a six and a half inch knife with a three inch blade. It's just literally just under three inch blade. Not that that matters because it's not legal to carry out shopping. But for all other tasks, absolutely fantastic. And you can put it anywhere right round your belt, left or right handed, whatever you want. Um. I have found a position in my front right, just above my pocket in my front right, uh, to the left-hand side towards my groin. I put it in there, which means my hand can get in and out of my pocket. And it just keeps this at the perfect place. If I'm holding, what I tend to do is I'm holding something up, I reach for a knife, bring it up, cut, put it back in again. That's it. An absolutely super knife for that. Now, it's a 4 mil stock. That's thick for a small knife. But this isn't a pocket knife. This is a knife that's going to do work. This is a knife you're going to be able to pry. I'm going to show you the tip. Look at that tip. That's a real good sturdy tip. I'd have no fear in doing that any damage. You have jimping on the top. Let's get this here now. You have jimping on the top, which is in the perfect position. Now, I get a four-finger grip. I have a large hand, right? When I'm in here, my, my last finger goes on this bend here, and it's not sharp. It's rounded. It sits in there perfectly. Full four finger, comfortable grip. And because of the little swell here going between the third and the fourth finger, it locks my hand in even more if I wanted to poke or do anything like that. But the Ricasso comes down here and gives you the most beautiful, you can push past that. The blade itself is Sandvik 14C28, which is probably one of the best blades for a little fixed knife. It's easy to sharpen. It's not well, it is easy to sharpen. It is a tough little knife. Really is a tough little knife. And I, I love this. It's going to come in different uh, styles. This is like a, a stone washed, a light stone washed version around the Ricasso and up the spine. And then this beautiful, beautiful blade. You can nearly see my face through it. But it's not a mirror finish, but it is an absolutely beautiful finish. Is it a sharp little knife, I hear you say? Well, I'll just show you. This is just a beautiful little knife for cutting. Absolutely super. Great little blade. Comes down to a thin edge, but it's not an edge. You can baton with this. You literally, and, and not be frightened. Now, you're not going to take on a tree, but if you're just going to, especially if you're splitting twigs, sometimes I'll just use the back of my hand or a bit of a stick. Just give it a wrap to split your twigs up for your fire. It can be used, it's long enough. This is just about two and three quarter inches cutting edge to cut your meat up, to cut your spuds up, to peel an apple. It really is, and it is comfortable in both directions. If you want this for, you know, security or a tactical way, especially those maybe in the States who are allowed to carry them, 
it is absolutely perfect for that. It gives you a full four finger grip and you have a lovely blade. Any way you want to hold it, it will work because this Ricasso comes down and locks your hand in. Love it. Really do genuinely love it. I will be carrying this down the caravan and you can pocket check me down there anytime. Most of the time I'll have this in my pocket because it's just a fantastic knife. So that's all you have to do to get on the action. So if this gets up and running, it finishes on the 3rd of December and there has to be 20,000 raids. There's already 8,000 raised in three days. So I don't see any problem, but do not wait. Get in now, you're just going to save a tenner on the next price that this is going to be. will be 79 so you're getting it for 69 £10 on a budget knife already. A budget fixed blade, let's put it like that. £69 is that budget, maybe just a wee bit over budget, but you're getting what you pay for. This 4 mil stock is beautiful. The fit and finish is best deck. It's just lovely fit and finish. Lovely lanyard hole. It's just so smooth. There's nothing hard or... It's, I can't explain to you how comfortable it is. And I can't wait for the first, first people to get this. I want them to come on and say, Paddy, you were right. This is a gem. It is just... It is an absolute gem. I back this 100%. I have no fear that if you buy this, you're going to get exactly what I'm telling you. It's a small fixed blade that will do big jobs. And it's also easy enough to fit on your belt. It'll go around your neck, wherever you want to carry it. This little tech lock, instead of those big fat ones, that they even do it on the small knives. They get it. But this was picked specifically to make this comfortable and useful and absolutely proper kydex sheet not a cheap plastic as some of them do tend to come in a nice little ramp here to push away on and you take your knife out safely beautiful i love it absolutely love it so and i hope you do too and i hope you'll back james get over there on the site again i'll put that link down below in the description just hit it it'll take you straight to the site and you too can get in on this. So it'll finish on the 3rd of December. And he's hoping that he's going to have the knives by the the early part of March of next year. And I know that £69 tied up. But what you're getting for it is really worth it. And he will post anywhere in the world. Anywhere in the world. That's how confident he is. And that's how much he's standing behind his product. He'll post anywhere in the world. And you have all the... The, the, the knowledge of knowing that James is not a new person around. In fact, he's been doing this a lot of years. Uh, I trust him completely. I back him completely. I have nothing that says to me, you shouldn't get this knife. What a nice thing to ask your kids to get you for Christmas. They can get the back the, the Kickstarter and they can follow the process through till you get your knife in March. I think that's a lovely birthday. Anything like that. Get your kids involved in buying you a beautiful slip joint slip joint fixed blade <laughs> but it is stunning it really is stunning so happy with it get over there the site will show all the pictures of it it gives you breakdowns of the knife all the sizes whatever get over there get onto it this is completely patty approved take care bye bye now